Hello friends. Welcome to a fun, fun day. It's homecoming day. Homecoming week for our older girls in high school. Today is homecoming dance. I say it that way because they're not actually having a dance. Per COVID restrictions, battery is flashing. Hang on. Okay, now you have a battery. So per COVID restrictions here in Washington state, and yes, I understand that some other states do not have any restrictions. It's fine, I like the restrictions because it's keeping our kids safe. But because of that, they could not have their homecoming dance at the high school as they usually do. So instead, they have decided to go and have it at the aquarium, which is so cool. It's down in Seattle, it's the Seattle Aquarium. I think it's gonna be the coolest dance and party that they could actually have because sometimes at dances it gets kind of like awkward and what do we do and you know like if you you know you dance and stuff but it's like need some conversation starters sometimes and so I just think it's gonna be really fun for them to walk around the aquarium have the lights from the aquarium tanks and the sharks and the octopus and it's a really cool aquarium and then they'll have music on and, and treats and it's gonna be a really good activity for them uh, so what their girls are doing this morning what I have been doing with them is we're cleaning the house <laughs> That's why I don't have makeup on quite yet also it's raining and I'm running out to get some things done um, because we're having everyone come over to our house to get ready. All the girls are coming over, including Jacob, Kaylee's date and boyfriend. Um, they just, it's a different era. They all wanna get ready together and hang out. So they're gonna be here in about an hour and I'm gonna go and get some pizza and I'm gonna make a salad. I think I have some vegetables I can chop up. Um, I think I have, do I have soda? I might have to get a thing of soda. Uh, so we can just have a little party here at the house. Hang on. I just can't see out my windows. <laughs> um, anyway, we're going to go get a few things and then we're going to follow Kaylee and Abby along as they get ready for homecoming. Abby is going. Um, let me explain a little bit of the dynamic. Kaylee and her date are the only ones that are dating. <laughs> so they didn't want to make it uncomfortable for everyone else that isn't actually paired up with a girlfriend or boyfriend. And so they wanted to make sure everyone felt included and they're just all going as a group. So they didn't want to have a formal dinner that they're gonna to go to and get a reservation for and, and all that kind of stuff. So they're all completely fine going to get fast food <laughs> in three different cars and eating in their cars because it's pouring rain. Pouring rain. So we're gonna make this a very casual homecoming, but it's the way they wanna do it. And it means that Abby will go with a bunch of girls and a bunch of guys to the dance as well. And she will meet other friends of hers from, the, from high school at the dance. And it'll just kind of be a big group. And I think that's a really fun, safe way for everyone to go. And I'm glad that they all recognize the needs of everyone in the group. Um, to be able to have fun. So let's go and get ready for homecoming. All right, so I just went and got some sodas for the kids. I am not going to drink those myself. Um, I'm waiting to pick up my pizza. Can't see the pizza place. It's right there, Papa Murphy's. Um, but I went over to the grocery store to see if I could get even just like a white rose or a any kind of white flower to make a boutonniere because I know it's last minute. But I took a chance and I was like, hey, so any chance I can get a boutonniere made by today at like four? And the guy's like, well, there is a chance if I knew what that was. So, <laughs> did not get any flowers. I, um, Jacob's mom made a flower um, corsage for Kaylee out of flowers from her yard. So I think I'm going to take it upon myself to go see what floral arrangement I can get from outside. I think we might be impressed. So let me go get the pizza and we'll be right back. I will 
not talk about where I got these flowers from. <laughs> Let's just say they were very pretty on the side of a road and they needed to be picked. So <laughs> I went ahead and picked these and we're gonna go see what kind of a little boutonniere I can put together. And I'll take the pizza in and I think I have just under an hour before everyone starts to get here. And really I'm not doing anything much after that. Um, they're all getting ready themselves. So as soon as I get everything kind of set up and prepped, then I'm off the hook for a bit until we start taking pictures and it stopped raining. Fingers crossed. I'm actually gonna put makeup on <laughs> um, for the kids to come over. But fingers crossed it stops raining for the rest of the afternoon so that we can come out and take pictures. I'll be really disappointed if we, if we can't get outside pictures. All right, so this is what I've got. I've got one little white flower a bunch of little white ones, kind of like a baby's breath. And then I picked out some greenery, different types of greenery. Now I'm gonna kind of do this like my little haiku headband that I did for Ashley for her baptism. So I've got my little stuff here wet down. I'm gonna try and just wrap it all together and make a little boutonniere here. All right, that is what I came up with. I'm actually quite proud of myself and it smells fantastic. I don't know what those little um, lighter colored twiggy thingies are, but I think it's actually like a minty or something. I don't know, but it smells amazing. So now I need to kind of make this bottom part look a little bit better, maybe with some ribbon or something. All right, I found floral tape, actually. Let's go see if Kaylee likes it. Do you oh, like that's it? Cute. Is that for Max? Uh, that's for yeah, that's for Max. Uh -huh. <laughs> no. Is that the one that it's for him. On his thing? Yeah. 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 She has one downstairs. Yeah. So you got all your. Let me see. Your little outfits right there. Cute. Everyone want to say hi. Hi. You tried your dress on or? They wanted me because I didn't know what shoes to wear. Oh. Look at the drip. So. Look at the drip. <laughs> Are you going? Yeah. Business casual. <laughs> The dork. And where's Max? Come here, Max. <laughs> oh, now you don't come. Come oh, here. He's camera shy. Oh, he's <laughs> never camera shy. Hi, Max. <laughs> don't lick it. All right. It's all done. Finished it off from the bottom with some little floral tape. And I'll show you what Kaylee's looks like. His mom made this one for her. Look how pretty that is. Isn't that cute? So I kind of wanted to make sure I did the ferns and kind of kept some similarities. I actually tried to find some flowers like that to kind of match, but it's kind of hard now that we're in the fall. So I'm just gonna stick that right there and then we'll put it back in the fridge, tuck it in there. We've got one pizza cooking so far and We'll cook another one after they finish eating that one, and I'm starving, so I'm, <laughs> this one's my pizza, and Jason's when he gets home. So, I'm gonna chill for a bit while I wait for these pizzas to come out. I'm just, I don't know if I'm gonna bother getting ready. We were gonna have a game night after everyone left, but now we're not going to, so why am I getting ready? <laughs> we'll just put the camera on her the rest of the evening. Let me see. Very cute, Abby. Look at how stellar Jacob looks. Dapper, I should say. And you're putting on her necklace? Yeah. And then he's got his tie. His parents are coming over soon, right? Yeah. And then their flowers are in the fridge. Yeah, and her necklace came in the perfect color of blue for her dress. Mm -hmm. Super cute. Look at you guys. Very cute. Okay, let me get, oh, oh yeah, Kaylee, get in there. Very cute. I'll get your guys' picture real quick. So cute! Aww.
coming early. Yeah. They've had a, we've had a lot of fun. <laughs> We almost had this. We almost had the shotgun on the front porch for you. <laughs> Jacob's taller than Dad. Yes, he, I know he looks really good. You're taller than. I'm not super tall. No, he's not. It's not hard to do. Keely's taller than him too. Yeah. Dadly duties kick in. Be good, guys. Remember who you are. <laughs> We've been doing this for the past hour and a half. Yeah, it's not exactly. I wanted to like meet him at the door, take him to the office, sit him down. No, it I wouldn't. Did. I know I you did. To get, like a little kid chair and have him sit in a little kid chair. <laughs> he's a good kid. It, it, he's, he's a, a really good kid. kid. If you see what we've been doing, you'll know that he's he's good. Glad I got to see him. Well, I am very glad that we went and took photos out in the street. That was exactly what I wanted it to be. Everything I wanted it to be. We will follow up with her later and uh, find out how okay. she enjoyed the night, but we're going to relax. <laughs> Wait, Chelsea's what? Every single day I ask her how she's doing and she's like tired. Because <laughs> she just doesn't stop. And then, then she comes home, she eats, Wait, she what's showers. The what? what? After the dance. What time is that? Oh, now he's like all paranoid. Well, no, I'm just saying, what's the curfew? Like I don't know what time. I don't know. I don't know what time. <laughs> I didn't establish this. Is this I will text Kaylee and find out when the dance ends and it'll be like a half hour to 40 minutes. He's not even paying attention to me anymore. Someone's phone just went off. They won't go past curfew because they all have like parents picking him up too. So we're not going to go wrong on this one.